inseparably compare me and the boys I like to Romeo and Juliet. But now I'm older, now I'm wiser, and now I recognize what real functional relationships look like. So it should come to no surprise. I want you to be the Harry to my Sally. Can you be the Zoe to my Wash? We could be like Hannah. I will fight you. Be the Frozo to my Venus or the Wesley to my Buttercup. We could spy like Benedict and Beatrice. You know we'd never get enough if we had fictional love. Just pour me a gin and tonic and I'll be the Nora to your Nick. You could be Scott Pilgrim to my Ramona. Or if either of us had to die, tragically or otherwise, I'd rather be your Hazel Grace or your Angel Du Chouinard. You could be the Zero Cool to my Acid Burn or the Ron to my Hermione. We could spy like Lizzie and Mr. Darcy. Oh, you know just how it would be if we had fictional love. Since I first actually read Romeo and Juliet in the sixth grade, it has driven me crazy how many pop songs reference Romeo and Juliet as this, like, ideal relationship. Have you read the play? A couple of swoony, melodramatic teenagers meet Mary Fuck and get themselves and others killed in a matter of days. It's not exactly the kind of relationship you aspire to. So I wanted to write a song about all the other awesome fictional couples out there that actually have really good relationships that you could actually look at and say, I just want to find the Nick to my Nora. And I just want to say, for the record, I'm sorry that the couples in this song were pretty heteronormative. There's only so many to choose from. I tried really hard to think of some couples that weren't just cis dudes, cis lady, but I did what I could. If I didn't mention your favorite awesome fictional couple, please let me know in the comments. Maybe I can work them into the song in the future. Oh god. My neighbor just walked by and looked at me funny. I mean, she had sunglasses on, but I think, I think she was looking at me funny.